Apparently, the world has moved from paper documentation of information to digital mode. Experts say this gives room for faster and more reliable data preservation for further use. At this 10th annual lecture of Institute of Information Management, IIM, with the theme Digital Rights Management, Business Technology and Barrier to Information Access, it was pointed out that finance, language barrier and inadequate education are some of the hindrances to accessing information in Nigeria. Sometimes we have information written in French. We cannot read French. We cannot understand French. So this information is useless for us. We must have a civil community that builds infrastructure, that moves, that helps the government to build infrastructure to get information available for all population. If you remove information from any country, any institute, any organization, nothing will be left. You remember the case of Bakasi problem between in, in Cameroon. Do you know that Nigeria lost that project, that land, Bakasi, because of lack of information? We didn't keep the records of the place. And when they got to the court, nothing to prove to defend ourselves. And at the end of the day, we lost that Bakasi to Cameroon. Awards were presented to individuals for their role in championing the course of information management in the country. There was also induction into various membership categories. Among the inductees into the fellow category was the Director of Production Services, Lagos Television. Being a fellow of Institute of Information Management will really help me maybe to be a part of the people that will drive, that will drive the, the growth of information in Africa. I'm very, very happy to be honored as an honorary fellow of the Institute. You see, without information in the society, the society cannot work. This annual lecture, induction and annual ceremony is the 10th in its series. And I am is optimistic that with their unrelenting effort at educating everyone, and government's commitment, information management in Nigeria will improve in no time. Sheifo Miola today, LTV News.